Life and Death. This is commentary from James Brown. As I write this, Matt Bonner is dying. Any day now. But he doesn't want to risk being forgotten. He has terminal cancer. To preserve his memory, for his loved ones, he's speaking to a legacy coach who works for the Eternos Project. Eternos, which sounds like a movie villain, collects letters, videos, photos, and interviews, and anything else clients like Bonner want to include to recreate their client's voice after their death using AI. I was simply amazed by the breadth of what can be done, Bonner told News Nation in an interview. Going is hard, but when you know that some things are staying back, when your legacy is staying in a vault and is available for your children, grandchildren, this gives you a kind of closure. I can go now, he said. Bonner, or some digitized version of him, on a server, will be able to talk to his loved ones. I understand the sentiment, but has anyone else creeped out by this? (laughs) Like an increasing amount of now, this sounds like a sci-fi movie. It's a bizarre side effect of the modern condition, a continuous feeling that much of our world is strange and beyond reason. I wouldn't do this. I don't think a digitized version of me is me. Would you? Let me know what you think in the comments and support my work at jamesbrowntv.substack.com. On that note, I'm James Brown, and as always, be well.